There's many different concerns with the American elm. There's, uh, there's elm yellows, there's elm leaf beetle. Uh, the, by far the most common and worst disease is, uh, is Dutch elm disease. So Dutch elm disease is transmitted by the elm bark beetle. Elm, elm bark beetle will hatch in the spring. It'll move from an infected elm over to, over to a healthy elm and infect the tree at that point. What happens is the tree's response to that infection of, the, of this fungus is to block up its xylem and its vascular system to keep, that, to keep that fungus from moving throughout the entire tree. What happens with that is the, whole, is the tree will start to wilt. So it'll start to wilt, usually in the top, top part of the canopy first, we refer to that as flagging. When we see flagging, it's, it's, a, it's a sign that the tree, the tree may be infected with Dutch elm disease. The way that we're most successful at managing Dutch elm disease is to manage this disease preventatively. The way we manage it preventatively is we do winter pruning to remove any dead, dead disease or damaged limbs in the canopy of the tree, and then we follow up with fungicide treatments. Fungicide treatments are done at the base of the tree. We do them in the spring that we inject into the tree. The tree, the tree takes up that fungicide, brings it up into the top of the tree. When the tree is fed on by an elm, elm bark beetle, that fungicide will meet that, meet that infection and stop the infection from happening.